How do F1 drivers see the road? Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to talk about how F1 drivers see the road. Formula 1 cars are some of the most intricately designed machines ever constructed, with hundreds of thousands of dollars of R&D spent making positive they are as quick and protected as possible. They are also challenging to pressure at excessive speed, so drivers usually want to see the whole lot around them. An F1 car is ergonomically designed to enable drivers to see the road at some stage in a race, even when seated so low. The driver has incredible ahead vision and the central strut of these days delivered halo doesn't have an impact on a driver's view that much. Wing mirrors permit an F1 driver to see at the back of them. When using a car costing more than $12 million that can hit speeds of over 200 miles per hour, the driver must be aware of what's happening around them at all times. In the video below, we'll talk about what the entire groups do to ensure the driver has the first-class visibility possible. Can F1 drivers see the road, in front of them? F1 drivers can see the entirety in front of them when driving, as nicely as a way ample into the distance to make corrections for any vehicles they are approaching. Everything in the automobile in front of the driver is in their decreased subject of imagination and proactive to ensure there are no obstructions. F1 drivers have to see as much as possible. Driving at up to 200 miles per hour with a blind spot in front of them wouldn't simply be unsafe for them. However, it would be luxurious in case of an accident. Everything from the driver's function in the monocoque to the positioning of the left and right wing mirrors is designed to maximize line of sight and reduce obstructions. A driver has an entire discipline of imaginative and prescient to each left and proper angles at once in the front of the car, permitting them to choose the house between different vehicles when overtaking and to make sure they maintain the cautiously deliberate riding line that contains them round the track. Can F1 drivers see what's around the corner? F1 drivers are aware of each nuance of every tune they race on. They comprehend each corner line into these corners before they even get there. Through simulators, unique video study, and practice, a driver doesn't want to strengthen eyesight that can see round corners miraculously. A driver heading closer to a nook has already viewed the whole lot they want to see. Their frontal imagination and prescience are excellent, and their recognition of different automobiles has been helped by checking their mirrors and consistent conversation with the pit wall. The chosen line maximizes their velocity into and out of the corner, which occurs in milliseconds. A Formula One driver is so organized for every race that there is no want for mind reading or extrasensory perception. Every nook is expected, accounted for, and nicely ID out lengthy earlier than the driver needs to worry. At such excessive speeds, this training lets an F1 driver nook at rates that make spectators balk. Why do F1 drivers sit so low? F1 drivers take a seat so low to reduce drag. The decreased driver, the less air resistance, and the higher the aerodynamics. Since each phase of an F1 car is constructed to be as mild and streamlined as possible, having the driver seated any more remarkable than the minimum required would make the automobile slower. Additionally, having the driver take a seat as low as possible also has protection advantages. The monocoque of an F1 car is, without a doubt, indestructible, so having most of the driver safely tucked internal will increase driver safety. The carbon fiber monocoque and the halo cocoon the driver and make the vehicle as aerodynamic as possible. How do F1 drivers see in the rain? F1 drivers see in the rain just as any different racing driver does, even though alternatively of a windscreen in front of them, they only have their helmet visor. This skill depends on the water strolling off it, as they don't have windscreen wipers. However, they can additionally use visor tear-offs from time to time. A driver's capability to see while riding in the rain relies significantly on the different cars around them. In moist conditions, Cars kick up a lot of moisture that hits any vehicle behind them. This is simply every other cause. It's fantastic to be in the first place because there won't be any more significant moisture on the visor. Can you drive in F1 if you wear glasses? There are no restrictions in the FIA policies that Kingdom an F1 driver can't put on glasses. If a driver wishes to, they should wear them during a race. There are, of course, picks for drinks and many drivers choose to use contact lenses because there is much less danger of fogging. A Formula One driver is allowed to put on glasses. However, the driver's capability to function safely at excessive speeds will inevitably question. Racing up to 200 miles per hour in one of the most stressful sports activities ever conceived requires immense talent and concentration. Having terrible eyesight as an F1 driver would make lifestyles nearly impossible. 
If sporting glasses or contact lenses skill the driver's vision stays 20-20, there is no cause they couldn't put on them. But for a driver to be capable of the method of the data they are assimilating at such a reasonably quick rate, now not being capable of seeing precisely what is going on around them should cause serious security worries for themselves and their fellow drivers. F1 drivers have no hassle seeing the street all through a Grand Prix. The vehicles are designed to provide a clear line of sight in front of them and to the sides. Drivers use aspect mirrors to see at the back of them, and their helmets and visors assist in wicking away any moisture at some stage in moist conditions. Hope you guys like this video. Let us know in the comment below. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. See you in the next video.